I've made videos about uh, knowing what's wrong with the economy with the help of the aggregate demand equation which is by far the best way to know if you want to have a comprehensive idea as to what's going wrong with the economy but uh, not most of us are interested to know which part of the economy is not performing well. Is it the government or is it the investment, the private investors, the household consumption is being affected or the trade? These are not the things that affect a common man slash woman, women. Mm. So what can a common man slash women, let's, let's not get stuck with the agenda bit, what can we do? how can we find out whether things are not going to be as okay in future the easiest way is to know how the manufacturing industry the industrial sector is performing keep a tab on it instead of finding yourself in a real um, difficult position instead of finding yourself in a soup uh, it's better that you keep a tab on how the industry is performing because when we uh, start out in economics the first and the foremost thing is like an ABC uh, that the productivity in industry would affect in the largest way in the most important way the GDP of a country so if you see all the countries in the world, whether they're developed or undeveloped or developing from US to Germany to Japan to France, all these countries have faced uh, economic slowdown in their countries, in their respective countries, after the manufacturing sector uh, had consecutive decline in their growth rates year after year consecutive decline no decline in the growth rate uh, in the in the consecutive quarters okay so uh, India is no different because this is the easiest way to find out where are we headed right and how does how, how do you know that you should start paying attention to it it's just that these or not all industries and manufacturing uh, units affect a common man but all those industries that are linked directly mm -hmm, all those uh, industries that are linked directly to the life of a common man like the electricity um, bills that you get the phone bills um, um, and other th industries not not so much food but to an extent yes uh, other amenities basically when you suddenly feel there is a surge in it the prices have suddenly risen oh my god the electricity bill is so hefty this time it's suddenly in thousands you get your bill around 900 to 1500 to something and then suddenly it is 4000 5000 that should be a wake-up call why are these industries so much have suddenly become such looters because they are facing a lot of lot of uh, losses and why are they facing losses because their productivity has gone down their productivity productivity in easy terms when you are able to make big when the profit margins are good enough when the profit margins are less that's basically because either they are not they're facing some demand problem or the th uh, the raw materials price have shot up or um, maybe investments have become dearer the interest rates etc so they are recovering everything from a common man so when a common man feels that suddenly everything that is connected to their life has suddenly become dearer has suddenly become costlier they should immediately start referring the uh, man the rate the growth rate of manufacturing sector in the country and when you see that for two consecutive quarters there has been a decline that's it don't do not invest hefty amounts in something you, which you would not be able to recover later on um, because more often than not that is the time when people start selling their properties and the the um, evil brokers 
mint a lot of money at the expense of uh, common people who are not uh, updated with the knowledge. So that's that for now. Please pay attention to the industrial uh, growth rate. Maybe from next time we can always such bad times come to us so that we are wiser for the next time. Um, yeah, that's it. See you again. Bye.